All right, this is our ankle dorsiflexion mobility. Ankle dorsiflexion is really just the movement of bringing your foot closer to your shin. So this is dorsiflexion, this is plantar flexion. Um, most people are pretty limited in their ankle mobility in this direction where you're pulling your toes towards your shin. And this can be really valuable to work on uh, to help you improve your gait, to help you improve your balance, um, and other movement patterns like the squat. So to work on this, we're gonna go onto one knee. So we're working on the lead leg here. All you're gonna think about doing is keeping your heel down on the ground while you drive your knees beyond your toes. If I'm looking directly down for my knees, I want to be covering both my big toes, anywhere between my big toe and my middle toe. So it's really important that you're not veering off to the side like this, at least for now. Here, we're just driving forward and I'm dropping the line, kind of following the path of my big, big toe, anywhere between my big toe and my middle toe, and I'm just leaning in here. So um, some people like to go in and out, work more dynamically. I'm warming up, I'll do something like this. And if I'm really working to improve the range of this movement, I might spend more time holding here. So you can see I'm placing my hands just above my kneecap to apply a little bit more load to assist me in the stretch. I'm feeling a deep stretch in the back of the leg. So you can do this. Um, if you'd like, you can also use a weight for some assistance to add load. So right here, I just have a kettlebell. I'm gonna place it just above my knee. And I'm gonna work in. So this load is gonna actually help me and assist me in the stretch. So I feel this a lot more deeply now. So again, you can hold it or you can work in and out like this. And then just make sure you do both sides. All right, give it a try.